Well, you can argue this is the most influential martial artist of all time, the great Bruce Lee, making his walk to the octagon here tonight, champ. Everybody wants to be Bruce Lee. They say they want to be like Mike. If you're a fighter, you want it to be like Bruce Lee. You want it to be that fast. You want it to be that charismatic. You want it to have an ability to just freeze your opponents. Your speed, your movement, just the diversity in the attacks that you can give your opponents would just confuse people. I mean, I watched him beat a seven foot Kareem at Jabbar to stay undefeated. Right. If you can do that, you can do anything. I fear not. Set it inside Ladies the octagon and gentlemen, of Bruce Buffett. This is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Eve Loving. This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out O2 Arena in London, England, it's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet tall, weighing in at 170 pounds, fighting out of Las Vegas, Nevada, Assassin. And now with his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Roosh. The Dragon Lee! Okay, protect yourself at all time, obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your corner. They touch him up and we are underway. gets underway and it's gonna be interesting to see how this matchup plays out definite striker on one side against another guy who can really do it all and in those situations normally the guy that's more well-rounded will be the one that will find success i want to see how this plays out well perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there nice kick landed by this gentleman I mean, he's cutting him down the sides with these beautiful leg kicks. So a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. Lee gets hit with a kick. Oh, looked like he might have been in range, but misses with the kick. Head kick. Nice job to land the knee there by the taller fighter, and I think I just heard Daniel Cormier say, I wish I was a little bit taller. You're a baller, though, DC. Well, he's the taller fighter, and I'm gonna land a knee to the body with relative ease there. Nice kick there by Lee. Wow, that right punch has been the money weapon for him tonight, and he landed it again there. If his opponent does not change something, he will continue to throw the strike until he makes it. Stop throwing it. Oh, and yet another knee finds the target. So a huge moment here. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. And both guys really throwing with authority. 
Yeah, he's mixed it all up. Well, he's got the kicking game going tonight. Lands another one there. A beautiful kick, and all I can think of, better him than me. Let's get busy with those hands. Huge block there. Lands a glancing right hand upstairs. Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one up? Trying to establish that jab once again. Big body kick. Glancing right hand lands upstairs. Goes to the body with the knee. And that left hook landed on the button. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Big ball punch land. Now we get back to range. Oh, just out of range with that punch attempt. Some fighters shy away from checking a leg kick. Check that one. Oh, nice knee to the body for him there. Very nice. Oh, he's got that right hand going tonight, DC. Connected with it there. He's thrown so many left jabs to throw that right punch straight down the pipe. It's unreal. Lands with the kick there, no pad on that foot. No shin guard, he's taking all of that kick every time he throws it. Real sneaky body kick. Nice punch by Lee. Yeah, he's mixing it all up. Back and forth we go! Right left combo by Lee. 30 seconds now to go in round one. Just unable to quite find that range. Final seconds. I mean, look at the commitment to kicking in this fight. Five minutes in the books. All right, so an entertaining five minutes. Let's look back at some of the highlights, DC. And I'd imagine a lot of these replays are going to be rooted in that kicking game that was on full display. Absolutely. You're going to see a lot of different techniques, but the kicking was the key to him getting ahead in this fight. He's out ahead now. He needs to stay the course and continue to do that as the fight goes on. All right, next round is underway. He really did a nice job defensively in the previous round. You're not always winning with defense in MMA, but the crowd was ooing and eyeing as he moved that head off the center I mean, line. it was defensive, really. Yeah. I mean, just the ability to move, to roll his shoulders, to get his hands up and block his head as his opponent was trying to attack him was a sight to behold. It was a thing of beauty to watch a guy with such a vast understanding of defensive fighting. You got to check these low leg kicks. There's the kick, it's blocked. Lee gets hit with a kick. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Great punch. Ooh, head kick lands, he's hurt. Watch these to the body. Back to his patented kicks here, but just out of range. Oh, and he caught the kick. Well, he's looking for that left hand, just out of range though with it. Oh man, that's a nice kick right there. He's doing a great job of landing that kick over and over again. Oh, bone on bone, shin slash foot, right to the skull. You see why I'm a commentator and not a fighter? You see why? Yeah, those aren't fun. I'm telling you, man, you get kicked in the head. A lot of times, it's the end of the night. Got a little experience with that. Yes, I do. A little bit. Horrible. Nice punch by Lee. 
right, so he's landed some good shots. You hate to be overly critical, but nothing really in terms of combinations tonight. Well, the jab has been looking great. How about jab, jab, right hand? Right. Because eventually you're going to have to put something on your opponent that's going to really make him pause. I believe the jab has been working so well, if he drops a big right hand after it, he may be able to finish his fight. Oh, and there's a land with the kick, so certainly a good sign for him there. When that's working, you know he's in for a good night. Nice punch land over the top. Still unable to find that precise range with the high kick. Well, he was a little bit lackluster in round one. You can't say the same here in this second round. He has really picked up the pace, an uptick in the aggression and the output, and starting to find his range here in the pocket. Man, doesn't take a lot of these kicks to produce redness. Look at the left side of his body there. Nasty. Nice kick there by Lee. Just missing on the high kick there. Ooh, what a punch. Oh, he somehow ate that overhand. Wow. Just a slip there. Whipped on the uppercut there. Oh, that is as big a strike as he has landed thus far tonight. Big, massive shot lands. Look at how tough his opponent is, though. Still standing, still in their fight. Big kick. Lands the right hand. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. It's such a fast leg kick. Back to the left hand now, unable to connect. What a body kick. Oh, single collar tie here. Oh, and he caught the kick. Oh, the kickboxing chops on full display with that offering, nicely done. Beautiful kick landed by this man. Lee going with the kick to the body, but unable to find the range. And he landed the right hand there. 30 seconds now to go in the round. Way to hide that leg kick. Man, looks like he's trying to set records here, landing all of these strikes. He is aggressive to a fault, and really has been all night long as he continues to pour it on. Gotta be careful here, though, not to gas out. Oh, good job defensively there to block the strike by Lee. Ten minutes in the books. Well, I'm not sure the extent to which he has recovered, but we do see the end of the round. DC, talk us through the replay. Well, he's a tough guy. He's going to make it to the stool. He's going to survive unless you put him completely out of there. Unfortunately, he's in there with a guy that does have that ability. All right, next round is now underway. Previous round, not necessarily a tough act to follow. Pretty good, not good. Pretty good round, but not the best round. Sometimes that's what you get when you have fighters that are so evenly matched. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You like this guy. I like this guy a ton. And to watch his punch, I just put a smile on my face. That jab is fast. Look at that jab. Well, just as he did the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes. And a good sign, too, doesn't seem to be slowing down whatsoever. Plus right hand is true. Ooh, nice knee to the body. Just what he needed there. That one snuck in. Nice strike. And he's looking for that left hand. Just missed. Right hook to the head blocked. Lee gets hit with a kick. That one appeared to land flush. 
Well, he keeps going back to the well with that left hand, just out of range. Oh, nice knee to the body, very nice. He understands that doing the body work will pay dividends the longer the fight goes. You take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. Real nice body kick lands. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. And they separate. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Man. Just over three minutes to go in round three. His hands are down. Three minutes remain in the round. Oh, and he connects there. Pretty nice punch there. Great job finding the range to land those punches. Oh, that's going to soften him up. Massive knee to the body. Oh, straight right. Oh, he's really starting to apply pressure on his opponent here. Different approach here in the last couple rounds, and it's the exact sense of urgency that you want to see from a fighter take the judges out of it. Nice one-two there. Again, he's looking for that left. It's not there. Oh, trying to turn out the lights with that roundhouse kick, but just misses. Look at the force behind that leg kick. <laughs> High-level MMA defense there, able to avoid the punch. Nice job by Lee. over when he throws that kick. Now connects with the right. Oh, he's looking to set up that head kick. No good. Pretty significant welt to the left side. Nice head kick. Straight punch land. He's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Oh, he got that inside leg kick to the target there, DC. You don't want to eat too many of those. No, you can't. It starts to beat up the inside thigh. That is a technique you use to really slow down your opponent. And he caught the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Nice, sneaky head kick. He blocks the punch. Nice punch lands over the top. Oh, big Superman punch there. There's no tell on that leg kick. Left hand. Oh, you gotta like the output here. So aggressive with the strikes, he continues to light him up. Gotta be careful here not to gas out, of course, but you gotta like the offense we're seeing from him, especially in this round. Big leg kick land. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. All right, let's take a look back at some of the highlights from those previous five minutes, DC, and uh, no padding, no glove on that foot. No glove, no padding, and look at the hip action when he throws those kicks. He's not only kicking just for feel, he's really trying to damage his opponent. And as the fight goes longer, you will start to see it taking effect. Nice. Nice. All right, we'll see how it goes here in this next round. A high number of kicks landed there in the previous round. And at some point, these are going to really start to take their time. They do start to take an effect whenever you're taking kick after kick after kick. And watching him fight with that knowledge and that patience shows his fight IQ. Well, he continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like he did in the previous round. This is a world-class display of striking here tonight. Liver kick. Lee's hook shot gets blocked. The defense saw that one coming. 
try to establish that jab. Back and forth we go. Big punch lands through the middle. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Head kick blocked. Lee gets hit by that leg kick. You may want to start checking some of these. Oh, that's a hell of a kick right there. He told us Thursday that he was going to be kick heavy tonight, and that is certainly a step in the right direction. He is landing that strike. He's very effective with it. Oh, nice flip there and a beautiful counter. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Ooh, what a punch. Clean left punch followed by the right. Look at him drive his shins into his opponent's body with that body kick. Devastated body kick land. Well, he is at his kickboxing best tonight. Another nice good series of kicks by him there. I mean, the kicks are coming in bunches. Normally, it's the hands. Tonight, he's going kick after kick after kick. Right punches there. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. Oh, just misses with the kick. There's no give on that leg kick. Nice punch there. Ooh, blocks the shot. That was a thudding leg kick. Beautiful kick. Hard shots landing on both sides here. Lee's torso, specifically that right side, has absorbed a lot of damage tonight. And here comes the purple, the black, and blue. A definite blue started to form on that right side. Just over two minutes now to go. Punch is blocked. Good punch, Lance. Powerful leg kick, Lance. Spinning back fist. Beautiful body kick, Lance, right under the elbow. All right, so a good series of kicks by him there. He has mixed it up beautifully, I think, on the feet tonight. He is kicking everywhere tonight. He's doing a fantastic job. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Well done to catch the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. Ooh, what a head kick. Able to check the high kick. Oh, lands a stiff punch there. Nice connection. Oh, nice land. Oh, man, head kick lands. Nice leg kick lands. Oh, look at that jab. Snapped his head back. His jab gets to the target so fast, and he always brings his hands right back to his face. Well, no surprises. He connects once again, and that looked like it landed right on that. Cut. Right on the cut, and he's targeting it, right? He's looking. You can see him almost putting a laser beat on that cut and just putting his hands on it. It doesn't take much. He's just keep making it split, showing his opponent that he has no mercy. Nice body kick. Lands the knee to the body now. Oh, well done to block that powerful kick to the body. 20 seconds now remain in the round. Wind it up on the right there to no avail. Final seconds of round four. And there's the buzzer indicating the end of round four. Well, a lot of high-level highlights from that last round, DC. Take us through the replay. If he fought like this, I would be comfortable entering him into a K-1-level right? kickboxing competition. He's that good at finding and landing those kicks at will. He needs to continue to do this as the fight goes on. All right, so after he landed a high number of kicks in the previous round, we'll see if he can keep it going here as our next round gets underway. 
He should stay the course. He's so educated with his legs and his feet that he's given his opponent a very difficult time trying to anticipate what's coming his way. Oh, huge connection by him there. He needs to get on his bicycle, John. He needs to get into space so that he doesn't get finished. Beautiful punch. the Superman punch. How about it? Well, he has landed some good shots, DC, but really unable to string anything together in terms of solid combinations. It's because he's not committing to it fully. He throws his jab. He may throw the right hand out there, but he's not really sitting down on the right hand. He really doesn't seem to have the intent on landing it. He's got to be confident that it's going to land, and he's got to really throw his whole entire body into those strikes. Look at the angle of that nice body kick. Oh, that's a good right hand. Oh, nice job to block the kick. Hands high, hands high. Nice job of hiding that head kick. All right, so he lands a jab there. Pretty nicely done, DC. You can really control a fight just knowing how to fight behind your jab. Well, safe to say he's not going to be going back to the hotel room to watch this one. He is completely out of gas now. I mean, he's exhausted. He's been beaten. It looks like he's starting to lose that desire to get his hand raised in this fight. Take the control out of yes. Get rid of him. Who's next? Who put their quarter on the table? Whose uh -huh. quarter do you get to play next? Beautiful body position. Well, I'm not sure how much more damage he can take to the body. You may want to drop that elbow defensively. Of course, that opens you up to damage upstairs. Pick your poison for him here as he continues to absorb damage. You don't know when that leg kick's coming. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Single collar tie now. Trying to inflict some damage here, but misses with the kick. All right, late in the fight now, he needs a finish or he's gonna lose this fight tonight. We'll see if he goes for it. I mean, he's gotta pull out all the stops. There is no more strategy. There is no more time to try to set up a punch. You gotta just start letting everything fly. Under two minutes now to decide this one. Oh, body kick attempt here, it's no good. Oh, thunderous leg kick on it. Limp it a little bit, tried to stay upright, but man, that changed the complexion of this fight. John, he's hurt. He's hurt really badly by that one big leg kick. And he connects there, DC. Great job landing that punch. Body kick now by Lee. Just out of range with that right hook. Some nice back and forth action here. Well placed kick there by Lee. Oh, good kicks. All right, less than a minute to go now in this fifth and final round. Oh, that's a nice strike. Going to the body there with the right kick. Real quick leg kick. Just misses with a left hook there. Big leg kick lands. All right, 20 seconds to go in the round. Big body kick lands. Final 10 seconds of the fight. Connects with the right. What a fight! 
Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. The judges score the contest. 48-47, 49-46, and 48-47. Declaring the winner by unanimous decision, Bruce the Dragon Lee!